Um, does that say going to say quest failed now? Well, I killed him, but uh, you have to either help these guys get in or turn the fuck off. And I just told them to fuck off, so you know, good for them. Now I get to talk to them, good moody guy. I'm not a zombie. Uh, I don't think you're talking to the person you think you are. Thought you were that damn ghoul. Well then, back to business as usual. <laughs> you were trespassing on Alistair Tenpenny's private property. Redder's an official business. Oh. Um, I guess I'm here to take care of the ghoul problem. Have I ever killed a ghoul? Um, I no, no sure, of sure course not. Um, I kill ghouls and rent -a cops. What the fuck is a rent -a cop? With attitudes who ask too many uh, questions. I guess that like a slang term for this guy. What this guy does on a security intercom. Oh, looks like we got a live one here. I think we better leave this one outside. Goodbye, kid. Try not to get eaten by anything out there. I'm gonna fuck you up, you know that? You know what, just let me the fuck in, would you? you again? Uh, oh, they want a hundred caps. Don't, it's not even worth it. It's not even fucking worth it. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna fuck these guys' days up. Let's see if I can do this. Why right, seven? Why is it seven, the hotkey? That didn't work. There we go. Yeah, uh, that's what you get for not letting me in, you cunts. Well, oh, they're gonna open the door. Oh, they he stopped being hostile because I put my gun away. Oh, they didn't open the door. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? Let's check the time. 62 minutes. Yeah, well, I might just stop. I do have to get up early. Uh, urban invader. Well, wait, my chest is hurt. Here, have a stim pack. Uh, I probably just shoved that right into my like gut, didn't I? I should probably start doing quests as opposed to wandering around like a nincompoop. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to wander around like a nincompoop some more and move up here in this direction before I leave off. I want to find the Nuka Cola Shack. Oh, this guy wants fucking water, does he? Oh, you twat. Um. So I'm going to go and find this shack. Oh crap, I just realised this part of the map is really dangerous. You will likely find many Yaogwai, Deathclaw and giant albino rad scorpions around this area. And it is quite a difficult task to take them down if you're not high level. Uh, which I'm not, obviously I'm only level 9, so... Hopefully things go better than uh, they are in worst case scenario, but if not, then I guess... Oh, what is this? Don't tell me it's already... Oh, it's just a normal red scorpion. Easy to deal with. Uh, if it's giant and albino, we're in a bit of trouble. Yaogwai, not so much, I guess. Deathclaw, kinda. I guess there's a level of... there's a scale of things that can happen. I definitely think there is a level cap on monster spawns. Similar to Skyrim, if you're low level you'll get dragon spawning. If you're intermediate level you'll get frost dragons and uh, whatever the other kind of dragons are, blood dragons. If you're high level you'll get elder and ancient, maybe even legendary. Uh, and the other one that came with a DLC, but uh, similar to this game I think, you know, high level equals giant red scorpions, then even higher equals albino, then even higher equals giant albino. Uh, what, what's this? This is an enemy. Oh yeah, I forgot, there's something so- oh this is a deathclaw, this is deathclaw valley isn't it? It's definitely deathclaw valley. I think. No, it's a red scorpion. Might just be the red scorpion place then. But this is a cool thing. 
these um towers around here, around these places, this might not be this one like itself. But there are lots of these towers around. You can activate electrical switches on them. And it will start up this uh radio signal and you can listen to it. Um Oh, it just froze the game. Oh there we go. It's Morse code. You don't know what it is, unless you can depict Morse code. But some of them have like cool stuff on them. Ah, oh, there's... is that the Nuka Cola place? There's a mole rat outside. Is that a mole rat? Looks like a mole rat. Let's just double check. That is indeed a mole rat. I don't think it was that far out from under the thing. It might be down there. Uh, there's a place called Deathclaw Valley, although I think that's uh, the northwest part of the map. Where's this enemy over here? It's a bloat fly. Great. Let's see if I can fucking vats it with a sniper rifle. Oh yes, MLG Gaming. Look at that, I'm like a quick scope god. Uh, what is, oh there's a, this is the mole rat isn't it? Of course it would be the fucking mole rat. Okay this isn't the place, there's another bloody bloke fly over there. But underneath this bridge somewhere is a shack with a woman in it, who's all about Nuka Cola and shit. She's all about the Nuka Colas, 10 Nuka Colas. There's also a quest where like, his his husband, or her husband even, is uh, cheating on her or something. And you like either have to kill him or help him. Like ki you have to one of three things: kill him. I guess that's just sort of like if you get bored, you can just kill him, or like tell his wife, or help him get away with a woman. I think he's a bit of a cock though, so I'll probably just end up killing him on sight. Oh, as soon as I've done the quest, else. The woman will be hostile then. Uh, this might be the bridge of the death claws on it. Because there was enemies there, I was wondering what that was. They're probably on the bridge. One of the bridges just says, covered in death claws. And this is the dangerous part of the map, so what is this enemy? Is this a uh, boat fly? Great. I'm not gonna even gonna engage it. Jericho can deal with that. Uh, there's the shack. This is the Nuka Cola place, alright. Right underneath the bridge. Ooh la la. It's a good day. I just jumped by accident. I meant to, uh, I was gonna press Alt to go into third person, but then I realized that's, that's not the button. But I accidentally, when trying to press Alt, pressed the edge of my spacebar, so. I jumped with joy. But this is the Nuka Cola place, isn't it? Garda Shade. Yeah, this is, uh, Sierra, blah, blah, blah. This is definitely the Nuka Cola place. Ronald, okay, it's not, it's not Ronald. Ronald is the guy that's like a bitch. This is the Nuka Cola woman, I think. Yeah, Nuka Cola woman. Pretty much Nuka Cola everywhere. Quantum written on the walls. Uh, a pristine machine which actually sells ice cold. Uh, oh no, this is what has ice cold. Antique Nuka Cola fridge. All the bullshit. You can uh, steal everything in here, kill the woman. But I'm actually going to do the quest when I return. So while she sleeps. I will uh, just stand around and uh, end the recording, but we'll talk to her next time, I guess. There's a clock in here and everything. It doesn't seem to work. But when she wakes up, I guess we'll uh, talk to her about the quest and then do whatever. But thanks for watching this recording session. I didn't actually plan to record today, but I had the day off and thought I felt like recording a little bit of something. And so uh, instinctively I recorded the thing that I least, liked, least needed to record. I already have 16 episodes of this to upload in one week more than enough uh, twice as much actually I only needed one episode per day and now I have like fucking three so I hope you enjoyed watching this and not read faction or anything else important so thanks for watching guys I do hope you are enjoying the playthrough and I will see you all later even dog meat just said goodbye that's how dogs say goodbye so I will see you all later guys how the hell did that not just wake her up